<laughs> Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Draw Fortress. Oh my God! I love the music, by the way. Um, I always like the song. Anyway, welcome back to Draw Fortress. It's been a month since I've actually really recorded. I had a little bit of footage that I had before that I didn't manage to get put up. I'm going to turn down that music just a little bit now. Anyway, anyway, god damn, it's been a month since I played, too. So, there are a few things I did since the last episode that I'm probably going to not remember. Um, I think the biggest thing is, and it's not up here, we need to go down, is... I cleaned off a lot of this, and I left it running for a little while. Um, I don't even know how long, but I did clean out a lot of area over here, but not any up here because that's, that's a little much. I pretty much just cleaned out down here, kind of near the water, in the, pretty much in the path that, uh, oh, you know, now thinking of it, a good, a good thing to do might just be to do this, too. Or this. No, that would help. Yes, I like this. And the fuck was that? I hear fighting. I hear fighting. Why do I hear fighting? Um, a gremlin is fighting. Where is that? Zoom to location. Okay, hold on. Dog's fighting in the other room. Okay, never mind. The dogs are just being dumb. And, I'm, uh, and apparently, I, I remember the gremlin thing happened before. It's not anything new. And it's just the militia dwarf fighting. Okay. Anyway, um. Like I said, I pretty much cleared out this area here. There's a lot of open space now, which is, you know, fairly useful. I mean, that's that's good. That's kind of what I wanted anyway. So that's good. It's perfect. It gives a, a lot of room for the dwarves to do stuff. I mean, then they can uh, they can fish up here. They can fish over here. And I don't know if there's any evil things in here anymore. There is that. There is that. Okay. There's a frog, man. Okay, that's good. I'm surprised they didn't come out when we were moving the stone, but, you know, what do I know? Get a little on pause that will let the dwarves get back to doing what they do. Why the fuck they're starting on that side? I'll never know. But you know what? Dwarves are dumb. The dogs are probably going to be barking in the background. I can't stop that. They're being they're being hyper today because uh, Naluri is gone. The reason I hadn't done anything for a month, as a lot of you people know, is Naluri had come over. And if you don't know who she is, she's a woman I care very, very deeply for that I do not get to see very often due to... Uh, it's complicated, but she was here. I, I, we spent the month together, and that's why I haven't been able to do anything. I had planned on doing some Dwarf Fortress videos with her, but um, we were very busy, so we never got onto that. I'm very sorry, because I did say t say to a few people that I thought about doing that, and it never came true. And that's my fault, so, you know, bugger on me. Bugger on me. Anyway, let's go read our doors real quick. How are they doing? Everybody seems to be doing fine. Now, okay. Alright, now before I forget again, the next thing that I, I was wanting to do was right here in this area. I was wanting to build a... a justice system. Pretty much a prison, so... That's what we're going to be getting onto today. We don't have any cages or chains. Chains. So we're going to have to get onto that. So the first thing we're going to do is I'm... I'm thinking about, and, I, and I'm thinking about this really hard, is uh, how I'm going to do it, because I had an idea for it beforehand, and, uh, you know, I forgot, because it's been a while, so don't expect me to remember everything that I wanted to do. Hmm. Yes. Hold on. One second. Let me think of something real quick. Okay, I'm pretty sure this is similar to how I was going to do it before. Um, and the general idea is the, uh, you know, the, 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 the three by three rooms in the middle. That's where I'm going to put the chain. And then I'm going to put, the, you know, the various amenities that the, the, uh, the people would want. So, I mean, that that's kind of the idea for it. So... We're going to let them move on to that. In the big room there, that's where I'm going to have the jailer be. Um, I can't remember if you actually have a jailer or not. 
Dungeon Master. There we go. He's gonna be the, du the Dungeon Master's room. The Dungeon Master. And I'll probably put little wall in. You know, that, that'll that go as it goes. We'll see how that happens, when it happens, but that should be nice. That's a nice little design. I can ha scale it up, because in the middle, that's where the uh, staircase is going to be. So all around the edges is going to be the rooms, and that'll be effective on all levels. I'm going to keep this thing. <laughs> and it is going to attach to a steel shield, that dwarf. Very good, very good. And it seems like we're on to a pretty good stunt. Back into our little dwarf fortressy little area. Um... Still some combat, these guys here doing doing their thing. How are my minor men doing down here? Pretty okay. Pretty okay. Uh, my FPS has dropped quite a lot. Um, it's down to 34. Um, it, I think it, I mean, at one point it was maxing out. I mean, we have a lot of dwarves. We have a lot of stuff going on. So, I mean, it's not a big surprise that our FPS is um, lower than it was at one point in time. But, uh, okay, this dwarf's fighting is starting to piss me off. And it looks like we have gotten some migrants, uh, which is good. And uh, we're no longer under siege, so that means I can actually go back here, go to G, and I can actually put back our motherfucking bridges. I know, it's a miracle. I haven't been able to do this in forever. So I'll just put up a... Probably Quartzite. I like Quartzite. Looks neat. If I can find, I got a lot. I got a lot of stuff now. Um, we have a lot of stuff. Everything from logs to rocks to metal to there's the quartzite. Oh, god, damn it! Wait a minute. Oh, that bridge isn't raised. There we go. That's part of the problem. So we just got to go down to this room and uh, have this get pulled. And there we go. That should. Do that. A dwarf should go pull that pretty quickly. Um, as you as you guys remember, I was planning on doing like a weird little thing to um, like have this room mimic the map up above, and I'm still planning on doing that. Can you can see like the outer lava mode, and you know, it's fucking I like that. I like that. But cool. Anyway, so we're gonna go back to BG because G is the button to make those things that we call alright so we're gonna go to G again uh, I don't think we're gonna do anything with this also it seems like the lava moat since the last time I looked at it is doing pretty well pretty well for itself I don't know what that is what the fuck is that I just saw something move it was like white. What the fuck was that? I don't care. How is it leaking? It's leaking in pretty slowly here, but you know that's fine. This is just sort of like an extra thing because I was I thought it would be funny, but it seems to be filling in at a pretty decent rate. It will eventually be all the way filled in. Not that we need it. It's kind of like an extra thing. Chances are, when this does completely fill in, it will increase the FPS quite a lot. Um, these are working really well. The dwarves are using this a lot. They're getting all the blood and stuff off them, which is, you know, exactly what we wanted. So, that's obviously a good sign. I don't know how well... I don't know why they're leaving all the buckets out there. The little snots, but, you know, whatever. I don't care. Let's go to Dwarf Therapist. Let's check out how many dwarves we got in this last one. We went from 106 to 115. Not bad. Not bad fucking bad nine dwarves. And almost all of them female, but two. God damn it. That's a grower, pump operator. That one's a liar. I don't like him. Potter. Pacifier. Animal dissector. Wound dresser. Uh, I don't care. Um, siege operator and a skilled armor user. So it looks like we just got more people for the military. Now how are our squads? All of them are maxed out. So it doesn't even really matter now, does it? Although I might make all these guys, since they do know each other, into their own little military squad. I uh, will see about that as for when the time comes. Now I think I did set these. Profile requires profile. What the fuck? I thought I had a profile manager. What happened to that? Or manager? What happened to the manager? Skilled organizer. Administrator. 
can. That's kind of weird. As far as a meager office. Okay, so Udil the Badoom Badoosh. Also, it seems like these are getting done fairly well, fairly quickly, too. I don't remember if I set these to be engraved and smooth and less. Actually, I think these have just been running for fucking ever, so you know, what do I know? Um, I will set this room to be very specifically Udil Managers, and then this is going to be not a dining room. He has no chair. Son of a bitch, he doesn't have a chair. I wanted him to have a chair. Uh, fucking free it. There's gotta be one of them with a chair in here somewhere. One of them that's close. Okay, maybe not. Uh, maybe not. Who's this room owned by? Son of Jesters. God damn it. That one's owned by Dwarfed. Out of names, guy. Fuck it, I'm assigning this bed and replacing him, giving it to you. And I will make this a throne room slash study, and then assign it to you, my manager. Now how's that for stuff? And it seems like he has sated, so we don't have any more doors, don't have enough chairs, but you know what? I don't think we really need any more goddamn doors or fucking chairs, so we're good on that front. Anyway, this guy's almost done digging the fishing tunnel, which is good, you know, I kind of wanted that. I'm thinking about actually, you know, just saying fuck it and digging out that whole area in there so we have more waterfront, but, you know, that would take a while. That would actually take quite a while, and I don't know if I'm up for that. But let's see how these guys are digging this out. Or, <laughs> digging it out. Building it up. I, I've, like I said, I haven't, you know, played or done any commentary really in a month, so... I'm probably going to be a little shittier than normal, so... Not that I'm... Anyway, I'm going to be a little shittier than normal, so... If I start making mistakes more often than usual, feel free to go ahead and ridicule me from dawn till dusk. Um, I kind of need it to get back, into, get back into the saddle. Anyway, I'm not a masochist. Not at all. <laughs> not at all. Anyway, um, hopefully they'll get that bridge down there built pretty quickly. Seems like they're also gathering items from around the edges too, which is, you know, kind of nice, but, uh, not really what I want. And a site, rapid granite, weird, all sorts of blood, blood, but anyway, so it seems like the dwarf fort is staying pretty, pretty well in intact. Um, I'm not quite sure what we're going to be getting onto next. We really need a lot more stone. Um, we really, we really need a lot more stone. Hold on, how's our stocks holding up? Meat, fish, plants, holy plants, Batman! When the fuck did that happen? Drinks is going down again. God damn it! Our plants just like shoot up from time to time. It's hilarious. But then again, we have a shit ton of farms and quite a few farmers, so I mean, it's not too surprising. Sir, a baby's been born. Oh, that's just great. Another mouth to feed. Yay, more mouths. Um, I'm going to go start making more blocks here, because we're going to need them. Obviously, that's something that we need in constant supply. These guys are still brewing drinks. They better get on to fucking brewing those motherfucking drinks. Also, the reason I wanted to set a manager is... Okay, I've already set these guys up to... Or some of them, not all of them, apparently. Oh, please don't let that be... You know what? Fuck it. Permit all. God damn it. I hate these things. I really do. And you know, it's not ter a terrible thing to have just the entire populace training in swords. I mean, honestly, it, it it might slow things down a little bit, but although considering I say that about everything, you know, this might slow things down, and this might slow things down, and you know, this might, and so will this. Uh, I think in, in <laughs> I think after a while, it's, everything's gonna get to a goddamn dead fucking stop. So what do I know? <sighs> oh well, what is in these? 
Oh, those are just like fireflies. 